Hey kids! Stormbringer here. And now, in my continuing adventures of a weirdo, guess what I'm doing today? Ha! I'm gonna be in a music video. Well, me and a whole lot of other people. You know what a music video is, right? Those cool little clips that you watch on MTV, VH1, whatever's cool now. The little clips that go with your songs, right? We're gonna be in a music video that's gonna be uh, being done by a local band. Um, not 100% on what to expect, but I know we're filming uh, on the grounds of Legends of the Fog which is a haunted attraction here in the area. This should be a good time, so uh, I'll see you in a minute. Okay, so this is the fun part. So the information I got from the director says that he wants everybody to be in costumes. Now, nothing specific. He just wants to be, quote, weird. <laughs> I can do weird. So what we're going to be doing here in a minute is I'm going to be getting started getting ready for the shoot. I'm also going to have uh, my uh, the, the long invisible bunny man will actually be with us today as the uh, well, I'll we'll ruin the surprise but he's going to be with us too. Now you might not recognize either one of us by the time we're done but just so you know I'll give you a sneak preview. That's it. That's all you get. I'll see you shortly. Apocalypse Rabbits. <laughs> so here we are. Well, I know what filming a music video looks like. Well, it looks a lot like standing around in the cold right now. But we'll take a look anyway, shall we? about the smoke machine. It's important. For about 20 minutes or so, I hope. Um, oh, God. I got a pee. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Hey, how you doing, man? I don't have to pee that bad. It's okay. I fell in. No, we wanted to see what it did, dude. That's why I was here. Cold out here, folks. Just uh, saying. Cold out here. Now, tell me a little bit about what we're doing here. Now, this is for a local group? 
Um, it used to be. Uh, this song is about 10 years old, but we've been trying to produce this video for about four years, and we've had little bits and pieces. There's a storyline behind the video, and what we're trying to do is the song is called Outlaws Have the Right to Kill, and it's a heavy metal video that's supposed to be part of a dream sequence for a bigger plot. Um, and our hopes are to use this as a snippet to solicit a bigger film and turn it into something. It, it, uh, it, it, this particular video involves a dream sequence where all these other characters that are here at the stage were in other dreams of his at one point, and um, the, the idea is to try to tie it into the bigger story with uh, using this song as a teaser. So ideally this will actually, in theory, lead to a motion picture. This would ultimately become a full movie? We would hope so, yes. Um, we have a, a, a whole story written for it, um, and the, the, the ending is still to be determined, um, but as of right now it's just uh, this song and the parts of the song that are supposed to be um, part of the dream sequence. We're just taking a, a minute and 40 snippet, a little piece before, and we're hoping to tie it into a bigger plot that eventually leads to a, a short film. That's awesome. That's a lot of fun. Cool. Um, now, where will the video be available to view? Where will people see it? Um, not sure yet. I mean, obviously, I think YouTube will be where we release it. Uh, we should be talking to him, too. <laughs> he like, yes, we do see you. He likes to Imp. He's sort of like, he likes to creep in the shadows. Mm. Oh, is that what that is? <laughs> um... It'll be on YouTube when we're done with it. We'll put it on the channel. Uh, and hopefully uh, this will also be on Kickstarter if we can work that out or GoFundMe. We're not sure which one we're going to do yet. Um, and we're going to use this as the teaser for the GoFundMe project. Awesome. And now when can we look for it to be available, roughly? I'm hoping by the end of the summer. We have. Uh, it needs to get warm and we need to do a whole lot of stuff with a car and a green screen for it to um, even be close to done, as well as a tattoo scene. Um, they're coming from the past into the future and then back to the past to bring their old selves to the future and um, we have a lot of uh, period pieces we need to figure out like the 90s and we need a car so I'm hoping into the summer but we still have a whole lot of stuff to squeeze in a minute and 40 seconds. Awesome. Well it sounds like a lot of fun. Uh, it's been very cold but uh, freezing. <laughs> we got some pretty fun stuff here and as you can see the mood is getting a little slap happy. Um, before we lose our PG-13 rating, I think we're going to call it Mike. <laughs> Thank you for taking the time. It's been fun. Uh, once these fires are rolling, we're just going to have to kind of pack up to the stage. And I'm sure you've all heard the song a couple minutes ago.